Hello guys, Major Colton here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a machine that you can use to make your friends go insane. Now, to make sure that this thing is most effective, whenever they are not on the server, it's best to put these underground, or like right under their house, pretty much, so that I don't know where it's coming from. And whenever they get back on the server, have a way to turn it on without them noticing. Like, just run over there and turn it on when they're away from the house, and they run away. And then when they get back, they'll be basically just freaking out because they don't know what's going on. You'll see what I mean. First off, I'll make the initial switch. And remember, this will be all underground, so you don't gotta worry about them seeing it. Put three this way. Then we're going to build a infinite energy switch, like infinite uh, energy circuit. Put three clicks on all of them. <clears throat> I'm going to branch off, and we'll start doing this, and this is only the beginning. And as you can see, we can keep on going with this. As you can see, you can make this larger and larger and larger, and the more you put in it, the worse it'll be for them. If you want to make it really interesting, you can do like on instead. Of, that's just the basic way. If you want to make it really interesting, you can do add extra repeaters to it and add random clicks so that they fire off at different intervals. so that it makes it even more chaotic. And if that's still not enough for you, you can actually do this again with another set so you have even more variancy in it. And as you can see, you put this under their house. Let's turn it off for a second there so we can restart it. Isn't she a beauti beautiful, monstrous work of machinery? What the? That's weird. Oh, never mind. Sorry, guys. That's where I was doing something with lighting earlier. You won't get that problem. That's something I did earlier. That's has nothing to do with this. And now let's flip it on for one last time. And as I said, guys, you can add multitudes of variancy and variables with any number of computers and just have this cover in any, like, a massive piece of land if you wanted. And it make it even make it multi-layered so that you have extreme like just constant door noises way worse than what this is and if you guys like the build uh if you like this little tutorial i made for you guys uh comment like subscribe i'm going to be putting out a lot more stuff like this here in a little like here recent soon and all in all i'll see you in the next video